Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, Rosie Cooks. Okay, I'm making some flanken ribs. Look at these, they're beautiful. I'm not gonna put like a sauce on them, I'm gonna make them as if I was making some basic uh, carne asada or steak. I'm adding some olive oil right there. And now I'm gonna put my flanken ribs. It's a hot pan. You can put any sauce, whatever you want. But I'm just going to put some seasoning. The sizzle is still there, but it's not as loud as before. So this right here is lemon pepper seasoning. Lemon pepper seasoning just always adds a ton of flavor. This is garlic powder. And right here I have onion powder. I'm just going to season one side. It's all connected. It's all connected. Okay, this is all-purpose seasoning. The one I have is adobo brand, but just an all-purpose seasoning. Now that's going to give my flanken ribs a ton of flavor. And I'm just going to let it cook up for a little bit until I really start to see a lot of this red coming up. The, the juices are all coming up to the surface. When I see that, when it's, but I, I just want to see it more. And then it'll be time to flip. Okay, so you can see a lot of the red juices have all come to the surface. So now I'm going to start flipping. I love to see that sear. Okay, now we're going to let this continue. A lot of their juices, internal juices are coming out, you can see. So I'm just letting it go. It's cooking up good from the inside. And eventually, I'm going to raise this heat because I'm going to want it to be really seared on both sides. So I'm going to flip them over again. So you might want to flip them a few times here and there just to make sure everything's getting cooked. So I'd say these are about 80% cooked. So I'm going to raise the temperature on my stove because I'm going to want them to start becoming seared on, the, on both sides. Okay, look at this. These are beautiful. Look at, you can see the little searing. They're a little bit charred. They look like they were on a, on a grill outside on the barbecue. And I can assure you all the seasoning, just simple seasonings on your ribs. You don't always have to put a teriyaki sauce or a barbecue sauce. These are going to be really good. I'm pairing it with some potatoes. You can even pair this with some beans and rice. Go Mexican style. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. Thank you for joining me on my channel. See you next time.